I am now the leader of Porto, and with this we can finally begin improving the nation, although I will stay low to Seno and Coco and fuck Rodok, but I just wish to put everything behind us and move on. I will honor the Brotherhood's request and not bend bleach girls. Just don't tell Master Asia. I'm so happy to finally be the leader of Porto. We will begin by building up our military and improving our infrastructure. We will continue to distance ourselves from the kingdom of Rodox, for they will not represent or be the legitimate nation for our people and they will not rule over us. Regardless of what people think of you, Rodox is a power-hungry individual. I believe what Green Engineer said about him. I do not trust him and I ask others do the same. But I wish to improve relations with the other nations. To the Triple Brave Union and all the others, I apologize for what Bright did and I condemn him and his actions for what he did to all of you. I hope with this we can begin the path to building our relationships. For now, I must go speak to Double Zeta Breaker himself about everything. Double Zeta Breaker, I hope you are doing alright, but I come to ask you about some things Bright said. I would go ask Rodok about this, but fuck him. I need to know the truth. He said you were both a Trump supporter, a Nazi, but I know that isn't true. I have many things in my life that I regret. So many things I regret. I wish I could go back and change it all, but I can't, and I must go on suffering with these regrets. I won't lie to you nor will I hide the truth. It is true. Years ago I used to support Trump, and I used to be a national socialist. What the fuck? But, but how? Why? No! Damn, no, none of this can be true. This was years ago back in 2016. I was much younger, much more ignorant. And even though I supported these things I never wanted to hurt anyone. But this was all in the past that I wish to keep forgotten. How did you learn of it? Only very few know of it, such as Stella and Road Doc. I haven't even told much of my wives about it. Not even Seto or Ranjiku knows. I got this information from Bright. I don't know how he found out maybe Road Doc let it slip or something, that worthless fucking bastard. This was so long ago. And even though I only believed and supported these things for a very short period of time, maybe a few years, I regret doing so and wish I could take it all back. I guess the only good thing that I don't regret is I never voted for Trump, only supported him. His vote wasn't even worth wiping your ass with why contaminate your ass with such filth. I never wanted to bring real politics into these videos that much, but it seems I have no choice with this. But no I do not nor will I ever support someone as weak as Trump. The lie broke promises committed crimes committed treason spread hate and divided the nation. I was never really nationalistic about America never taken much pride in it difficult to do so when there is so much hate and division. I do not keep up with politics that much anyways anymore. As regardless that is not much for a single person for me to do anyways. Regardless of reasoning I will never make a difference so I no longer bother. In these video a single person can make the greatest difference. However in the real world the individual doesn't matter it is the masses. What? What about you being a Nazi? The term I used back then was national socialist as back then I viewed the word Nazi as a derogatory term. But even though I believed in such things, I never ever wanted to hurt anyone. Never thought it not even once. At least I hope so as my memory is no longer as good as it once was. But I must say this and I know it will be hard for some to listen to and I understand. If I could go back I would rather just be a national socialist than a Trump supporter. For he is nothing more than the most pathetic of jokes. And to support someone like him is the highest of disrespects to oneself. I will not target nor insult any who support him or any politician. As some may be watching these videos. You do not attack the people of the dictator. Attack the dictator himself. I think Black Bomber and being a Trump supporter share the same level of regret in my mind. I do wish I could go and take it all back. I have less regrets of being a national socialist than I do a Trump supporter that in it of itself should tell you just how worthless he and his ideals are. The Austrian painter would effortlessly make Trump his bitch. Maybe do something about that horrible tan and hairdo he has. But Trump is effortlessly an example of a beta cucked bitch. One does not need to joke or insult him. He will effortlessly do that himself. But with all such things will not take accountability for his own actions and find ways to blame others. Such as the so-called election fraud. It was not election fraud but the people not wanting a giant Dorito in office any longer. I could insult and make fun of Trump all day as that is all he will do is insult others. But I no longer believe in nor am I a national socialist or support such things. Even more so for Trump as I view him and his ideals even less. The second a leader seeks to take the rights and happiness away from its people is the very second they lose any of my support. I do wish the people could come together and love and be happy. But it is a nation engulfed in hate and division. Something that I do not wish to be a part of anymore. Conservatives and the right wing seem to be the center of that hate right now. They claim to wish to protect children. But what do they do after they are born? What if they grow up to become something they disagree with? Like a left-wing Democrat or homosexual. Will they not come to hate that child? They strive to take the rights and happiness away from people they disagree with all from what an ancient book says. But tell me, what has God done for them, for anyone? Except curse us with a life of war and loss. 
Nothing but pain and damn us to hell. A life we did not ask for. Was God there when you got cancer? When you were raped or molested? When you lost a loved one? He is a God that failed. Did he help you through it? No. And then they blame them for not believing hard enough and damn them to hell. All could be avoided if God never created them or better yet not be so incompetent. But fuck all of that shit. I lost my faith in God. And now I don't know what to believe in. But these conservatives and Christians claim to love and want to help people. But yet they take the rights away from people. And make their love is more harder. And take what little happiness they have away. This life is already fucking difficult as it. If you claim to love and care then you will allow what little happiness people can have in this life yet you try. Take it all away. They allow right-wing extremists to go as I have seen with the Nazis in Florida. And don't do anything to stop their hate. If they truly care. If they truly care about the children. Then they will stop these groups before the very ones are hurt by these hate-filled people. But I have seen they only care about their own interests of hate and mask it with love as they all do. They though are the ones full of hate and evil. But I am sick of all the hate. All I wish is for people to get along and love each other. But they have forgotten how to do so. Should you waste this life with hate or spend all eternity wishing you could have loved? But I don't wish to talk about this anymore. I'm so sorry for bringing real politics into this. But after all of this, I believe you will hate me. No, I don't. I mean, we'll make mistakes in the past. I mean, we should not go on regretting the past, but learning from it. And I view all of this as an outlet. I mean, I could see you are troubled by a lot as am I. But regardless, I know you are not an evil or hateful person regardless of the past. I'm glad we could talk and get the truth. I'm so sorry for everything. I mean, if you ever need someone to talk to, I'm always here. But I need to go. I need to return to Leading Porta. I congratulate you and the others on your victory and wish you the best, my friend. I will be the first to recognize your nation, and I wish you and all your people the best, my friend. Thank you and you, my friend. Goodbye for now.